Hi, this is my Bedini motor. I tried it out. I've seen multiple videos online. I decided to try it out for myself, and it, sh it seems like it works. What I did here, I have uh, this. These are just two batteries here and here that I got from a just a little Power Wheels, a little John Deere Gator, and that kind of stuff. This battery isn't any more good. It doesn't take a charge from the wall outlet or anything so I'm not even using this one I'm using this one this one is is okay it'll take a charge even though it doesn't last long so I'm trying this the interesting thing is that I'm charging this this is my run batteries I'm using two 9 volt batteries I hooked them in series I got 16 volts but everything's I didn't change anything on the circuit everything is the same thing as the Bedini circuit I just changed the battery. I was using another battery, but I, I just didn't. It, the bat that battery is fully charged, and I'm just trying to try different things with it. Anyways, my coil here is 850 turns by Fowler, 26 gauge and 23 gauge, and this is my wheel. I will make a video in detail to show exactly how I did it, step by step, to show you. This here is something I was making just to try to make it fancy. I was having problems with it. That's why I went back and I just did it on my breadboard to make it work. Some I don't know if it's a transistor or there's something not working right here. But it works on my breadboard. Anyways, let's give it a shot. The, the only thing I, di I did different here is I don't have a switch, a, uh, the potentiometer, rather. But So what I did, I just bypassed it. I just put, him, put it straight into here. And you don't even have to give it a hard turn. You just barely give it a boost. If it's just enough to get that battery, that other magnet around, it'll it'll take it and run. It'll slowly pick up speed. And that's only with one coil. My goal is is to see how much energy I can get out of this bad boy right here. I'll put coils all the way around it, and uh, all this is a bicycle wheel, and that's basically it. I will have everything instead of this rat nest right here. I'm going to have everything nice and neat right here, which is what I tried to do, but I'm not sure what went wrong. But anyways, as you can see, the wheel is picking up speed on its own. It's going to get the pretty fast, pretty high RPM. The, um, the battery was down to... Okay, let me get this in there. It was, it did get all the way down to like 8, I mean, uh, 1280 something. Now it ought to be close to 13. That's where it was earlier. It's wanting to climb a little bit. It's going to keep climbing slowly. And then here, my, uh, these batteries weren't all the way full either. I'm getting, a. Uh, 1560, 1561. Uh, earlier I was getting a little less than that. It seems that these batteries charge too. If you, when everything's hooked up right, even your primary battery gets a charge. Um, so anyway, that's my Bedini motor. I will have a detailed video coming soon. So uh, subscribe to my channel. Coming soon, I will have step by step on what I did, I'll, what I'll do when I make my other coil to put on here. And as I'm building a circuit for it and putting everything on nice and neat, I'm gonna go step by step, show you how to do it. Thanks a lot.